It's Emma here, the Bookish Princess. On the fourth day of Christmas, I bring to you a throwback travel vlog. These videos are from a trip my family took back in 2018 to Lake Placid, New York. The Olympics were twice held here, and it's just such a charming town. It feels like something straight out of the movie White Christmas. You can go skating. We got plenty of that in. I thought it'd be fun to have a little winter escape. Hope you guys enjoy. That's the noise from the ski jump in Impressione de France. Exactly. Except this is the Adirondacks instead of the Alps. Look, they've got a fire going. This is such a beautiful view. There's a gold marrow on the floor of the elevator. That's cute. This is so pretty. Here's the bathroom. Quick look in there. The view out on the lake, which is so cool. You can see the skaters. And guys, wait for it. You think this is a closet? It's not. It's a cute little room. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look at the sunset. Light just sneaking onto the mountains over there. Ah, how gorgeous is this? You can see all the activity in Mirror Lake. The dog sled rides, oh my gosh. The sun on those snowy mountains is so gorgeous. There's the pasta bar. So delicious. basically a little of everything. A bowl and a half. Ate this, got mostly olives. 
dart got yeah. are those blueberries. <laughs> They're blueberry peas. Oh no, no, huge no, those blueberries. Are. They're olives. <laughs> yeah, see? Huge. Yum. The great thing about this pasta bar is you can go back up as many times as you want, which, I mean, how much pasta can you really eat? That's the question. And it will be answered. <laughs> Yeah. Athos has already finished his first pasta. What are you gonna go for for the second? I think I'll try that spinach pasta with something. I'm not sure what. More olives. Big this prep. time I went for the sweet red pepper sauce with a tiny bit of Alfredo. Lots of vegetables, tomatoes, bow tie pasta. Dart went for the pesto, Alfredo, rigatoni. See, this is what always happens to me. I get through the first plate of pasta and I'm like, I could eat pasta all night. I am still so hungry. And then about a third of the way through the second plate of pasta, I start to hit a wall. So how are you doing? You you finished your second plate of pasta. Look at Dart. Dart is just a machine. There was too much sauce, so I had to get more bread. What? Are you going to have a third? Are you going to go for a third plate? This is such a pretty lobby. After we have dinner, we always have to hang out. Look at the bobsled. Oh, look at their little snowmen over here. I think they have like a movie room back here. We've actually never stayed at this hotel, but we always come over for dinner. Oh wow, look at this. Oh my gosh. I don't remember them having a library. Oh, and they have tables set up in it. This is so cool. What books do they have? Ooh. Athos just told me that Porthos is and always has been a Cardassian spy. And I'm very upset. This is such a pretty room back here. It's the bar. Look at these timbers. And the fireplace. I think they have a second floor, don't they? So cozy. We fire skate. We're going to get some sharpened to come on. Oh, tomorrow we have to go to where do you get that hat? To get a hat so that people can ask us where we got it. Where'd you get it? Skate sharpening here. Please use other drawer. See, isn't this handy right next to the hotel? And get our shape, skate sharpened. On this spot rested Lord Stanley's cup. Yeah, so we actually just bought um, the figure you skates at uh, the Lake Placid Skate Shop. Yeah. They were so nice there and like the prices were the same as they were on Amazon. Luckily they had our size. But yeah, the skate shop had these gorgeous figure skating costumes. I learned to figure skate when I was little, so like I need a toe pick. I'm sorry, I can't do hockey skates. I didn't buy one of the beautiful skating uh, costume dresses. There was someone in there with me. <laughs> Were you thinking about it? I thought about it. Well, actually, I saw them as I was walking out. If I'd seen them sooner, I would have thought more seriously about it. They were sparkly and beautiful. There are no sparkly skating dresses in this hockey shop. <laughs> What are you saying? What's ice slacks? Okay, you can see. Ice lacrosse? <gasps> Is that a thing? What ice slacks nowadays? <laughs> That's good. We've got our sharpened skates. They actually do have a light out on the lake, so you can skate at night. Although, obviously, we're going to have to get up early tomorrow and go skating at first light because that's super beautiful. Are we going to take the skating trail? The skate. Oh, yes! There's a trail that looks like they, they haven't done this in the past. They always shovel out a spot on the ice. But I've never seen a whole trail um, going around the lake, so we're excited to try it. Stairway to dog sled rides and ice. Oh, we're going straight to the ice? Yeah, we're going straight to the ice. Beach access, aka ice access. 
It's so weird to think of Lake Placid in the summer as a summer destination, but people come here and canoe and swim too. But now it's time for the ice skating. <laughs> it is, it is uh, icy. It's a lake. What do you expect? What do you, what do you think of it? Oh, I love skating. I don't think you guys can see, but the stars over Mirror Lake are so beautiful. I know, this isn't Lake Placid. Surprisingly, most of the attractions in Lake Placid are near Mirror Lake. Oh, look at that fire! Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Our room is one of those rooms up there. There's a beautiful lobby with the Christmas trees. That looks so cozy. <laughs> I think that the pasta place, what they need to have is a little skating break. So you can have two plates of pasta, or like one and a half, Take a quick skating break, and then you're ready for another plate of pasta, because I'm ready for another plate of pasta now. Go back over there. The fun thing about the tap water here is that it's really nice and fresh, because it comes from the mountains. So here's the upstairs balcony. I snagged this little seating area. I think my brothers are gonna come, and we'll play some cards, but I also have some knitting. I got this kit uh, from Webbs for Christmas. I think it's gonna be beautiful when it's done. I also have a little Christmas mouse. It looks like the seats by the fireplace are open too though. Earlier it was quite crowded with people playing card games and things. All of the apres ski activities. It's an apres ski for us. We're not actually skiing. It's so expensive to ski at White Pace. It is cool, we've done that in the past. But um, this is just a quick trip. So we're gonna be skating and exploring some of the fun stuff in town and just relaxing and enjoying the beautiful resort. So if you're going on a winter trip, most of your outfits will be covered up with your coat the whole time. So the main thing to think about bringing are maybe like a different hat for every day or a different scarf for every day. Today I wore this one, so tomorrow I actually made this one myself. Maybe I'll go for this one tomorrow. Camera focus isn't. I think the snow behind you is. Okay, here you. I'll stand over here. You stand over there. Yeah, now I can see it. Okay, so here's my outfit of the day. 
skaters current I found on eBay. Nice and swishy. Sparkly arms. I should go out and go see this these boots are Uggs, but this outfit would look even cuter with my skates. Been. It's very close to freezing, but I guess it's not quite freezing because it is raining. So we're not sadly crossing the lake. I was hoping to go for a spin around the entire lake this morning. There's the golden arrow though. You know right there? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're so funky. Dark magic is a great name for a coffee. I went for the maple. There's, there's sourdough pancakes. Sourdough. Flapjacks, which are buttermilk and sweeter, and then sourdough, wow. which are buckwheat. We're gonna sit over here, I think. Impressionist, right? Yeah, they're really pretty. Oh my gosh, look at that one. That's lovely. They have Rangina. I also got a Coke Madame. So I basically feel like oh, Rangina. Yeah, I did. I did. What'd you get? I got the sourdough. Uh, <laughs> what? I got the sourdough. Uh, sourdough. Sourdough. Super delicious. Saranac sourdough. Everything was really good. I really liked my croque madame. I really liked the Athos's yeah. sourdough pancake. The downside of this place is that there's not a lot of parking. It is kind of small inside, but everything was so good. I love my mom's calabred French toast. I really liked Athos's sourdough pancakes. I think next time, remember this, Emma. The next time I'm here, I want to get the sourdough pancakes. Maybe with some berries. I feel like they would be really good with berries. But everything was just super delicious. The potatoes were really good. So we had a delicious breakfast, and now it's time for cupcakes. Cake blasted is so delicious. Thanks. <laughs> libraries that's the Lake Placid public library there it's just adorable and right down the street from it is Adirondack chocolates so you basically have everything you need do, 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 do. 
do 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 Pine trees. The book depository box. Do you guys see anything? Oh, for a second I thought it was Elizabeth Gooch. It's Eileen Gooch. Disappointment. You can look out for the lake. What are you looking for? Hello. I'm searching for books. What kind of books? I'm checking. I'm checking the lore. <laughs> of Lake Placid? Deep. Porthos loves Russian literature. Best short stories of Dostoevsky. Yeah, I'm not sure if I read The Honest Thief, but I've read all the other ones. I love how many staircases there are. You can get lost in this library. A really good library you can always get lost in. Look at Emma. Classics. It's correct because it it's to raining. me it's raining. It it's been raining. We always have to stop in the bookstore plus cards, books, supplies. The store is all pajamas. That's incredible. The Gatling gun still in rubber band. See, now, now we're going to come into the Alpine Mall from the outside. That's where we got coffee this morning. So if you're staying at the Golden Arrow, it's pretty fantastic. You can come right up here and get back to your room.
Looking good. What is that Philippine music? It's from the battle between Anakin and Obi Wan. <laughs> Obviously, because that's what goes with skates. That goes along with just about everything.